Squirt, squirt. Yo, 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 what's up, what's up? We back again, what's happening out there in them streets? So it is the same day, it is the same night. It's not super, super late. I think it's only like one in the morning, but uh, it took quite a while to organize those 518 cards. That was, that was pretty serious. So what it is, now that I've got it all separated and organized, okay? So it's like I had mentioned before, it's 11, sets if you including the subsets so to break that down to what that really means is check these out right here we've got the movie animation edition and that's got subsets the tv animation edition the series 2 tv animation episodes edition and the series 2 tv animation and then i also have the tops chrome a monster with tons of extras We'll go through that last because there are tons of Topps Chrome cards. Okay, luckily there's tons of Topps Chrome cards. So, let's just start. Where should we start on this? We, you know what? We're going to do the other sets. The, the, no. Yeah, let's do it. First, we're gonna do the regular TV animation. Boom. All right, these are all in order now. So we're gonna try and keep them that way for the most part. Let's do it. This is like such a piece of Pokemon just history and like such, oh, it's just incredible to own this and to be dealing with this at this time right now. I just got these back today. This is the same day that I recorded the last two videos. Okay, so let's explain here a little bit. Boom, this is the checklist card. These came with a checklist. Now on here you can see there's one through, what is it? It's one through 70, one through 76. And then there's the TV1, TV2, TV, all that, down to TV13. So that's one set with the subset. Okay. <laughs> so let's do it. Let's go through them. Get these out. Very carefully. Delicately. And let's do it. Let's go. So we got Bulbasaur. I'm trying to do this pretty quick because the last two videos were like, what? Almost, they were like 40 minutes and a half hour or something. And this is doing all those cards in one video. <laughs> so I'm going to try and do this kind of quick. All right, let's go. Ivysaur, Venusaur, Charmander. Beautiful Charmeleon. You see him, look at that big dog. Too bad he got a nine, but it's just the regular TV animation edition. He got a 10. And what I mean by that is, this is the least valuable. It's not the most valuable at all there's three there's gonna be three different set versions that i'm about to show you of this same artwork okay there's the tv animation which is what we're going through now then there's the tv animation hollow complete set holographic including the tv cards or whatever they are at the end and then there's the chrome set which is the same artwork one through 76 chrome all right let's do it so Metapod. So out of those though, 
out of those three, this would be the least valuable because this is just non-holographic, regular Topps TV animation set. Then the holographic version, because when you open this up, these packs, you can get a holographic version of any card in the set. It can be random, any card in the set. And I have a complete set of all of the rainbow holographics. Boom. Gashasta! And it's beautiful. Boom. So these sets together, they're all backwards now. I'm just gonna stack them along and then I'll put them away. I'll peel them back into where they came from. But these sets, um, what was I getting ready to say? I forgot what I forgot. They're just mind blowing. Oh, okay. These sets only come out to be, I think it's like 300 cards for just one of each card in the set. And I had, it was a 518 card submission. The reason it was so massive is because there were a ton of extra Topps Chrome cards. And Topps Chrome is the most valuable out of all of those sets. So that's a good thing. So I sent a bunch of extras of that in different variations, sparkles, spectra, lots of spectras, a couple sparkles, one techno gloom that came back a dime, came back a 10, gotta love that. I had, I was hoping it would, it was a beautiful card, beautiful condition, of course I was hoping it would, but... You can get these bad boys out. These cases hold 30 cards and it holds them pretty tight. 30 slabs. Okay. Let's go, my peeps. Let's go. We got Nita Queen. Nita Ram Mail. Nita Rhino. See, these are all in order now. Beautiful. The fairy. Fable, Volpix, Ninetales, Ninetales only got an 8.5 for some reason, it's weak, Wigglytuff, Zubat, still beautiful though, these cards are the 9.5s, 8.5s, you can't, I mean unless you're like truly examining the card, you can't even tell. Unless you're like really getting in there on the corners and the surface and the edges. Of course, dimes are what we want. And like I had mentioned, if there was any set that it was okay for me to get the lower grades out of all the cards I submitted, this would be the set that I would have chosen. But we still got some tens in there. We got lots of high grades. Hey, I think I got this in order. Let's go. Came on. Little polywall. Polyrath got the ten. Look at these beautiful cards, though. These beautiful slabs. And I like the black and gold GMA label. I think it is very attractive label. These slabs feel very good in the hand. They're nice. Don't get me wrong. They're not Beckett or PSA when it comes to value. A GMA 10 does not hold the same value as a Beckett or PSA 10. If these were all the same exact grades but PSA or Beckett... This would be over six figures easy. This would be a hundred thousand dollar collection easy. With it being 
GMA, it cuts that it it cuts that in half like off a rip. Pretty much cuts it in half. Which is very unfortunate, but it is what it is. Okay, boom. So you saw all those beautiful cards. Is that all of them? Let's see. Uh, 70 TV4. Nope, you got to get these ones. This is the last of the TVs before the non-holographic. Like I said, I have a whole, no a whole other set of this, just the holographic cards. Which is so much harder to come by. To accumulate that kind of legend. Okay, let's see. It's getting unorganized and it's kind of freaking me out because I just spent like hours organizing all of this. But hey, I'll organize it again. At least they'll be pretty much organized. Okay, so since we did that, let's go ahead and do the hollow. Let's do the hollow version of the same set. Let's go. So we'll start with. Come on out, baby. Boom. Checklist, but boom, it's hollow. You see it. Same card. Just hollow. Every single card in the set. Let's go. Do it. I'll get them out. Come on out, babies. Let's get one. If it's super full and you can't get it out, just pull out one or two first. Easily. Then you can get them out. Because you always want to be super delicate with your slabs. You don't want to bounce them around. You don't want to drop them. Anytime you pick up a stack, be super careful because they can flip out or try to. All right, let's go. They had to give my dog a seven. That's crazy. The look, look at the holographic. The whole thing is holographic. Now, overall, you would expect this set to get lower grades than the one that we just showed. Simply because anytime you have a card where the whole thing is holographic. It makes it hard to get a good grade. <laughs> it makes it much harder to get that dime. There's a couple in here though. That Charizard is gorgeous. Right there, holographic Squirtle. That is gas. Right there. Blastoise Blastoise only got the nine. Look at that though, gorgeous. Oh. Caterpie. Metapod, I really gotta speed this up, homies. <laughs> Butterfree, Weedle. Kuna, that beautiful Beedrill, Pidgey, Pidgeotto, love that Pidgeot, Pidgeot's got that yellow in his hair, that's the most distinguishing factor, Ophiro, Gleaming, and these cards gleam so much. There's so much holographic. Look at that Pikachu. Okay, that's one box. Let's do it. So we're, we're four boxes down and like 10 to go. Let's go. Now we're going to stack them and work our way down.
We did Arena. Little Queen. Beautiful. Wait till we get to the Chrome cards. That's when the high grades kick in. For some reason, the Chrome cards. Oh, beautiful Vulpix 10. That's a good one to get a 10. The Chrome version seems to fare better. Something to do with the makeup of how they made the cards made them last a bit, endure better time. There's a 10 gloom. Stink Puff! Stink Puff got a 10. That's my girl. What up, Stink Puff? And I, t with Chrome, the Chrome set being the most valuable of all of these, when I was gathering these cards up for this submission, I'd been gathering up Chrome cards for a while. In Chrome, I really went after the Chrome cards because it's so much more valuable and it's just a gorgeous, beautiful set. I mean, don't get me wrong, this is a gorgeous beautiful set as well all of these are i love the top sets when i was younger i wasn't crazy about them but now so much time has gone by look at that arcane and gleaming so much time has gone by i really appreciate these cards now big time Polly wog but the chrome cards are incredible as far as the grades that i just got because you're looking at all these, right? And we're getting tons of 8.5s. That was a 7, another 8.5. Tons of that. Well, with the Chrome cards, it's going to be like 90% tens. Because I've got gathered up a lot of Chrome cards and I vetted them well. And that's what happens. That's why the Chrome card, like the Chrome cards, I, I've got a good chunk of Spectras and a couple Sparkles. The one techno, the techno gloom. That card is. All the technos are. That's just a really awesome variation. That thing is so gas. The way those little cubes. Little cubics. My girl Jesse only got the 8.5. James got a 10. Okay. So, that is, oh, nope, here we go. And I love that Meowth artwork, and the hollow version is super gas. So, that is two sets with the subset for each one. Boom, two down. Okay. Now we will do the movie animation edition cards which are gonna be pretty interesting. Let's see. Oh, these are dope too, these are dope. The Mewtwo Strikes Back movie cards. When you get them all together, complete set, fire. This also has a checklist. Boom, we'll get to that. Okay. Lots of cards, folks. All right, those are the, we need to start there. Okay, so here's your checklist. Now this set, boom, you see it. It's got a bunch of Mewtwo Strikes Back cards, and then it's got a couple, where are they? Can't even see them on this. Oh yeah, they are, e-cards. Boom, let's do it. These start off real gas. 
These are sideways. So we got boom, a Mew. Got the 10. Mewtwo breaking out. We got the, got the nine. Look at him, he's free. Got the 10. This is like the evolution of the movie right here. So it's super dope. All right, he's leaving the nest. Giovanni steps in with the proposition like, yo, let's be partners. Gets them all strapped up, mechanical Mewtwo. That's a 10, these got some good grades. That was a 10. Easy, baby. All right, let's see. He's trying out his new armor. Rebellion. I'm too hungry to work. Let's have a Pokemon battle. <laughs> Everyone loved Dawn Fan for a while because of that. Because he was in the beginning of the first movie. He got whooped though quick by a solar beam from my dog, Bulbasaur. That's my dog. That's my dog. <laughs> All right, let's go. All right, they're all crossing the water. They get to the... Brainwash Nurse Joy. So dope though, the way they did this, that it like evolves the movie. It's the evolution of the movie. They just went through and took screenshots as it was playing and it came out gas you watch the movie by looking at these cars pretty much well no not at all but i mean if you know the movie you can watch you can look at these cards and you feel it you feel it i feel it you feel it no i do i feel it in my bones all right let's see oh saving pikachu Throwing that shadow ball at Mew. Charizard getting bit on the neck by the clone. Ash getting blasted. All the Pokemon crying because he's dead. <laughs> Another time Ash died. He died so many times. Oh, but they bringing him back. Oh, and then they learn a lesson. They haul an ass together, friends. Oh, look. How'd we get here? Boom. He sees it. That's an awesome card. And it got the 10. Because that is an awesome card. Look at that. Woo! And then it jumps over to Pikachu's Vacation. If you got the first movie on VHS, I think it was maybe DVD 2? No, that was way too early for that. On VHS, it came with Pikachu's Vacation before the actual movie. And it's like 20 minutes or something like that. All right, so let's do it. Tokubi's hungry. Boom. Wow, what a collection. Squirtle puffing out his chest and then he races Meryl. They get shocked by Raichu. Oh, too many. Don't do it. Don't do that many. He's up. Charizard trying to sleep. Got his head stuck in the thing. They pull him out. That's dope. Boom, so that's three. Oh, oh, nope. I almost shorted you. That's got a subset too that I almost forgot. 
the evolution subset, a cool subset. Let's go. Pretty dope subset. Boom, look at that Charmeleon blowing it. It's gonna be me later tonight. Charizard, what's up? Squirt and squirt. Old headbutt. Turk Cannon. What up, Pokematic, me brother? Dratini. Dragonair saves Ash's life. Dratini. Or er, Dragonite. Dragonite is my, you know what, let's look at that Dragonite one more time. That is my wife's favorite Pokemon. That is gas. Okay, so that's three sets, two more. We're going to go through, let's go through the Series 2. Chrome, these are Chrome Series 2, right? No, no, these are just regular Series 2. Alright, where are we at? This one first. We're running out of room, y'all. This is a lot of slabs. Takes up a lot of room. Come on out of there. So this is... They came out with a Series 2 for the TV Animation Edition. And it had basically all the Pokemon from the original 151 that weren't in Topps Chrome Series 1. The main hit cards in the second, but it had like, you know, it had, uh, there's so many good ones. It had Flareon, Vaporeon, Jolteon. The main hit cards were Mew, Mewtwo, Gas, Super Gas. Okay. So here's our checklist. And let's go. Boom! Ponyta! Rapid Ash, see, it takes off right where it left off. 78, what well, was 77, then 78. Slow, bro. Slow, bro. Magnemite. Magnetone. Far fetched. Dodrio. Or Doduo, I mean. My bad. We gonna get the Dodrio. The Series 2 was boss. Both of the series were good, though. Series 1 was gas. Series 2 was gas. Series 2 came chrome. And it's worth a gang of money. A ton of money. Just like all the chrome. Get them out. Okay, we're getting into the movie cards. Because this set went... It was... Like 77, which was Ponyta, through... I think it's actually 115. No, 117. Through 117. Which is Cedra, And then it has two subsets in this one. <coughs> A tiny one and a big one. All right, boom. So next we got Hitmonlee. Monchen. Lickitung. Copper. Where's it? I don't know what kind of noise Rhyhorn makes. <laughs> or Ride On. Ride On. Chansey. Tangela. King of Sky. Or C. And Cedra. Boom. And then it goes to like only like five of these. Yeah, only like a couple of these. The HV1 cards. You see my girl, look at her. Gorgeous. That's my girl, y'all. Stay back. I know 75% of the dudes. <laughs> Watching this, my homies are like, no, that's my girl. <laughs> okay, then we come down to these. Oh. Now, this is each episode 
from the from the original series. Not every episode. It only goes up to like 40 or something. Not even. That's Misty's sisters. Her big sisters. Let's go. That's crazy though, right? Seeing all these cards, complete sets, just like all near mint to mint plus many. I mean, we're about to get to the chrome and that's where the gem mints really are. But just all incredible condition. This is the last of that set and then it's the chrome. Chrome for your dome. I'm gonna take me a little break and come back. <laughs> That was dope. It's where Pikachu defeats the Raichu. Lieutenant Surges. Oh, that is gas. Look at that. That's awesome. Because that was a good episode. The Maiden in the Tower or whatever it was. What's it say there? Ghost of Maiden Peak. Butterfree found him a girl. Got tens on both of the Sabrina cards. There's another one coming. Boom. Look at them. Tens on both of them. A boom. Primal freaks out over that hat. He gets Ash's hat. Okay, that's that, y'all. So we'll be back in just a matter of. Okay. Now it's pretty late and I'm pretty tired. <laughs> All right. No, it's not that late yet, I don't think. But anyways, let's get back to it. This, all we have left is the Chrome. All the Chrome cards. The way that they're stacked right now, I'm just going to start with the closest box, which is actually going to be starting at the back anyways. Which is fine because the best cards are the last cards. They're, what, number three, six, and nine. Three, six, nine. So, firstly, though, somehow I forgot. I didn't. I forgot these slabs. In when well, I didn't box them in there, I'll have to add them to it. But so perfecto. Look at the look at the beautiful chromage. Some double mankeys. You're gonna see a lot of doubles in the chrome, and triples, and some quadruples. Because I did it. I sent them all. Okay. So these are in order as well. Oh, but we're working from the back. Looks like. What's going on? Yeah, we're going to have to work from the back. No, that ain't going to work. Okay. One second, please. I gotta pull the bottom box out, and they were too deep. There's that. Then that. Then that. Okay, we're getting that. Put these back. Okay, boom. Do it. Let's go. So this is going to be Bulbasaur, right? No, it starts on the other side. This is going to be Bulbasaur. Boom! Yeah, my dog only got a seven. They had to do my dog dirty. Let's see. Eight point five on the Ivysaur, but then boom, they tried to make it up made it up to me. Venusaur got a 10. Okay. Boom, you see it. Look at that gorgeous card. Look at it. The Chrome's ca Chrome cards have like a little bit of a 3D effect going on to them. You see it a lot on the Charizard. 
So we have the 10 Charmander, followed by the 10 Charmeleon, followed by the 10 Charizard. Look at that. Look at that. Wow. Absolutely beautiful. Look at all these tents. There's a little bit of, you might see a little bit of dust, cardboard powder dust on here. No biggie. That's from the boxing. 10 on that Blastoise. <laughs> and then a 7.5 Caterpie. But don't worry, there's eight more. <laughs> Caterpie is one of the ones that I have a ton of. Boom, 10, 10, 10. Oh, there we go. A Spectra. Spectra Metapod 10. Butterfree got that 10. Kakuna! I sent in a gang of Kakunas. That's my dog. Kakuna! Yeah, there it is. A nice 10 Spectra B drill. Hello. Gorgeous. Breathtaking. All those tens will take your breath away too, right? I had a lot of chrome cards. All right, let's scoot these over. Let's get into this box. I think that one that came out with a chunk. I'm hyper fang somebody. God, these cards just say so much. I don't even really feel the urge to speak right now looking at these chrome cards. Some money right here, y'all. This is a lot of money. Like, you gotta think, right? Each one of these Chrome cards, if it was a PSA 10 and not a GMA, granted, it's not a PSA, it's a GMA. If it was a PSA 10, this Ekans would probably be an easy $100. Easy. The Arvok would probably be 120 if I had to guess. The Pikachu's probably like 400, 500 if I had to guess. I could be way off on that, but I'd be I wouldn't be surprised if I'm not. I'm talking about the Pikachu specifically. And look with Boom. With 10 Raichu, you know what I mean? Spectras. 10 Spectra money very blessed i feel very blessed to be filming this to be looking at these right now i hope y'all enjoying it my peeps because i am makes me want to go get some taco bell and sit back and just look at these for a while eat and then look at them just look why not? <laughs> All right, let's see. Boom, we got so many duplicates. I, we only got four boxes left, so. We've almost accomplished our mission. Just hang in there. Boom, right on top, a Knit Arena Spectral 10. God. It's a little obnoxious.
God, I love seeing those tens like that, though. <laughs> I mean, of course, right? Especially when they're your cards, you just got graded. Dang, that Spectra. The queen got a nine, followed by some tens, though. Only one of these cards. Oh, that reminds me. There's going to be two cards in here. The Niddle King's one of them. I think he's coming up soon. That is going to, are going to be an old label. They were not part of this submission, quite obviously. They were cards that I just couldn't find a good enough version of that card. In a good enough condition, I mean. To send in with this batch of the Chrome cards. And I already had 10s that were just old labels. So I just added those two cards to it. So Meowth and a Niddle King. So we got Nidorino. We're about to see him. A lot of Nidorinos. There it is. Let me see. Yes, I only have the one. See the difference in the label? The new label is so much better. So much more attractive. But to complete this set, I needed those cards. So I've been holding on to that those two cards. Just holding oh no. on. You say it's puppy love, we say it's full grown. There's a ten nine tails. <coughs> Boom. Sparkle Golbat. Wow. Beautiful. 10. Gem Mint 10. Followed by the 5 Gold Bat. The one card that I didn't realize had a crease in it or something. Uh, oh, wait, no. I think there were two cards in this submission that were like that. But anytime that you submit massive quantities of cards, that usually happens. Ooh, there it is, right on top. In the corner of the camera, you can see her. She's chilling and grilling. And there's that Meowth with the old label sticking out like a sore thumb. <laughs> All right, we will work our way to it. Oddish, Oddish, Bloom. Boom, this card's some money right here, y'all. I mean, it's not like insane, insane, but it's a good chunk. Look at that techno sparkle, or not sparkle, it's techno holographic. It's just beast. A bunch of little squares. If you look on the back, techno, techno chrome. What up? What's good? Wow. Put that aside. Okay. Vile Plume, my little stink puff. Paris. 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 Parasecta. Parasecta. Parasect with a whole spectrum. My internet don't work that good because I got spectra. I mean spectrum. <laughs> if y'all ain't from around here you, you probably don't know Spectrum They do alright I have my Venomoth 10s Little Diglett 10 Spectra The 10 Spectras Are just And the 10 Sparkle And that 10 Techno That's next level A bunch of trio, trio, trio. Love dog trio. There's that old label. Persian. Lots of Persians. Say yay.
Okay, we got two boxes left. That's it. Let's go. And this one won't even pull all the way. Okay, 75, 70, yep, let's go this way. I'm gonna jump. Got him for days. We got him for days, y'all. Love the tens. Love the nines too. Hate the nines. <laughs> No, I love the nines too, but really love the tens. Ooh, Spectra, only seven though. I put these in here, these are, uh... oh no, they're chrome, yeah. Okay. I think that's where they ended the chrome series one. Was at the pony top. Can I do this far? Nope. Oh, wait. Yeah, I did. Okay, one more. Yeah, I didn't do them completely in order. That's the problem we're having here. Because <laughs> this box is 56 or 67. And we just did the 70s. That's why that box wasn't a full box. Because it was the last box. This should be a pretty nice box. Mankey. Sparkle Mankey. Primey. Oh, you see that Spectra Primate 10. Gorgeous. That's why I sent in so many of them, though, because you see these ones like... I'm getting an 8.5 on one and then a 10. Well, not on that Growlithe, but. A Poliwog. Spectra. Spectra 10. Just a little Poliwog Spectra, but still. Mad respect. I respect that Spectra. This is it, y'all. One more handful after this. Ooh, Spectra 10 Abra. Cadabra pointing at you. Alakazam. Alakazam. Spectrum of Chop, only a nine though. Tens for days. Boom, and that is it. That's it, my homies. So you've seen it. That's that 518 card submission that we got back. Boom, we slayed it. We killed it. That was amazing. I hope you enjoyed it. I loved it. I hope everything great with y'all out there in the streets. I hope you're having a great happy holidays. Nothing but good fortune. Blessings. Share the love. Until next time. Peace.